welcome to the mathematics in my channel today we are going to solve another interesting integral integral from 0 to 1 x over e to the x minus 1 dx okay how to begin well first um, integral from 0 to 1 here x over uh, this e to the x I am going to write 1 over e to the minus x minus 1 dx now we can simplify integral from 0 to 1 here we know 1 minus e to the minus x over e to the minus x uh, this e to the minus x we can write in the numerator so x times e to the minus x over here 1 minus e to the minus x dx okay then integral from 0 to 1 x times e to the minus x times here 1 over 1 minus e to the minus x dx now integral from 0 to 1 x times e to the minus x now instead of 1 over 1 minus e to the minus x I am going to use a infinite sum uh, series so we can write sum of uh, n is equal 0 to infinity we know this is equal to e to the minus nx uh, here dx well now we can switch the integral sign and uh, sigma notation so we can write this is equal to sum of 0 to infinity integral from 0 to 1 x times e to the minus x times e to the minus nx so we know e to the minus x times n plus 1 dx okay then here we have 0 to infinity now I am going to write n is equal 1 to infinity 0 to 1 here x here e to the now here 0 so here 1 now we should change the power so here e to the minus nx dx okay then um, we can integrate this integral uh, by um, parts method so I am going to integrate x times e to the minus nx dx here uh, so uh, we can write we can take x as a first function then d by dx then integration of this function so e to the minus nx over minus n dx then product of these two functions so x times e to the minus nx over minus n so n here minus then minus here minus so plus uh, n is a constant so we can write outside of the integral sign so 1 over n e to the minus nx rewrite this function here and uh, times uh, derivative of first function so 1 so here only dx so we can write now minus x e to the minus nx over n uh, here plus 1 over n integral of e to the minus nx we know e to the minus nx over minus n plus c so this is equal to minus x e to the minus nx over n minus e to the minus nx over n square plus c okay now um, we can write this is equal to uh, sum of n is equal 1 to infinity now instead of this integral we can write um, minus x e to the minus nx over n minus e to the minus nx over n square uh, limit from 0 to 1 okay then we can plug in boundaries so here n is equal 1 to infinity 
now if we plug in 1 uh, here minus 1 times e to the minus n so we know minus e to the minus n over n then if we plug in 1 here uh, minus e to the minus n over n square then minus if we plug in 0 here 0 minus minus plus so plus 1 over n square then we can write n is equal 1 to infinity uh, here 1 over n square so 1 over n square minus infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity e to the minus n over n square then again minus n is equal 1 to infinity e to the minus n over n okay then we know uh, uh, infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, 1 over n square is equal to uh, theta of 2 theta of 2 then uh, this is equal to we know natural log uh, 1 minus 1 over e uh, minus natural log so minus minus here plus uh, natural log of 1 minus 1 over e and we know this is equal to d logarithm of 1 over e so we can simplify theta of 2 we know 5 square over 6 5 square over 6 uh, then here we can simplify natural log of e minus 1 over e so natural log of e minus 1 then uh, according to property of natural log division we can uh, write uh, minus natural log of e natural log of e we know 1 so minus e minus li2 1 over e okay this is the answer for this integral if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching